I believe there's only one dangerous spider in this box. Another giveaway is happening. All you have to do is follow KF Invertebrates for your chance to win a tarantula or a praying mantis, just in case you're not into the whole eight-legged pet thing, which is totally fine. I get it. For those of you who are interested in purchasing a tarantula, I encourage you to go check out their online store. They have such a wide range of species. All right, without further ado, let's go ahead and open this up and meet our new friends. <laughs> I unboxed the box and my camera wasn't recording. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry about that. Okay, so what did you miss? I'll I'll fill you in. There's something in here. I'm gonna put that to the side. We got four new babies. Four new babies, you guys, all different species and ones that I do not have. I'm very excited because one of them, actually all of them, I really, really wanted to have in my collection, but one of them was my dream spider. I tried to get this species from Fear not, but they were out at the time. We'll start with this one. This is the Gramostola Pulchra. Now these guys have a nickname in the tarantula community, the Black Lab, because of their demeanor and their, you know, they have a pretty chill temperament. And if you were into handling, I'm not, but if you are into it, these are these are pretty good for that. Now, but I will add Every spider is different, and even if they have a reputation of having a good, you know, docile demeanor, always check with a soft paintbrush or a straw even um, before ever handling to see, you know, if they have an attitude that day or not. These guys have a beautiful, deep, dark, velvet black color to them. They are so beautiful. That is what drew me to them. Medium to slow growth. Uh, to give you an idea, when this guy is three inches, it will be probably about 14 months. So it is, it does kind of take a while. Females can live up to 30 years. How insane is that? That's, that's insane, right? Obviously males, they don't. Sadly, they do not last as long. No tarantula male last so long. <laughs> I don't want to be a tarantula male. If I get brought back, please. Thank you. <laughs> Put it in my notes. <laughs> so they're ground dwelling. They make burrows under logs and sticks and whatever. I'm going to go ahead and get a little uh, enclosure together and then we'll get him inside. Okay, so I just put together a little enclosure and we're gonna go ahead and switch to the other camera so you guys can get a better look. Okay, but before we do that, look what I just found. How cute is that? Oh, that is an isopod. If you guys don't know what that is, some will, some will know. This is an isopod. They're called rubber duckies. I wanna call any of them, okay? They are so cute. So what I did is I took a, it's like a, a I don't know what this is, it's a cap from something, I don't know, I don't remember. But what I did is I, I hot glued it right here. Now dry substrate, because these guys, that's what they're, they're from, they're from a dry climate. But what you'll do, just in case he or she wants to have a little humidity, you're gonna overfill their water dish, okay? Here we go. How cute, how cute, how cute. Make sure it's the grandma's total pull crop. Okay, good. <gasps> Hello, he's in there, like swimwear. There we go, there we go, there we go. Oh, look at him. Oh, that scared me. I'm okay though. Okay, so that's adorable. He's so cute and I love you. You're my new baby, oh. <gasps> look at that, that's so pretty. So this is how I fill up a water dish. I take a straw, just fill it up like this. This is how I do everybody's water dish. I'm gonna overfill it. Go ahead and get this lid on. Oh wow, I'm in love. This is the one I really, really, really wanted. Oh yes, thank you so much. Remember that little one, the Aviculara Aviculara was crawling on my hand. It was so cute and I named him Boots. He died. Sadly, that's what happens sometimes. So this is a little tree spider and they're so, like 
beyond gorgeous. So when they are little slings, they are a bright blue. And when they become adults, they are pink, purple, blue, green, like insane. This is the Caribbean Versicolor. I'll, I'm sorry I'm not building the enclosures on camera for you guys. So I'll do it with this one. So this is usually how this goes. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to build it like this because these guys like to build webs at the top. Now, if I put it like this and I keep taking his top off, I'm going to keep messing up his or her web, and I don't want to do that just to fill up the water. You know, that's kind of a crappy deal if you've you know, got to build my house again. Well, at least I ain't thirsty. These guys also like humidity. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to be taking some moss, and I've dampened the moss, and I'm going to mix that with some, uh, what is it called? Zoomed, right? my zoom ed soil and then have that filled up on the bottom so that way there is it you know the moss just holds in the moisture more you know the soil is right <laughs> you get it check this out i found this was this is on my from my tree in my backyard now i know it is not a good idea sometimes to go outside and get things from around your yard because you don't know what's been treated with bug repellent and pesticides and i think that's the same thing but but my tree in the backyard well, it's my neighbor's yard. Hi, neighbor. He watches my videos. <laughs> it's like a little scoop, which she, he or she will probably go in there. So about like right there. Okay, so I'm gonna take it about right there. I just broke the whole thing. <laughs> well, shoot. Okay, there we go. Nope. <laughs> kind of. Hot glue gun. This, you guys, this is so much fun. I mean, putting these things together, that's what I did. It's mixed with moss and... You already know. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to just put this together because I have some type of camera shyness when it comes to putting things together. It's taking me a lot longer than what I would do if I wasn't recording though. <laughs> So I tried to, uh, you know, make it like a tree thing, and then I put the water dish, I, I hot glued that to one of the six. And so I made kind of like, tried to make like a little tree. <gasps> Here we go. Hello. Oh my god. Oh my god, the color. Time to come out. Oh, yes, yes, yes. <laughs> stay, stay. Stay, stay. Look at that. How cute is that? Welcome, little one. I am blown away. Look at that. You are active. All right, let's go ahead. Go. There you go. All right. Ooh, that's a nice bubble. Okay, well, I'm going to go ahead and close this up. I'm very happy that she's... Oh, no, 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 no. There you go. There you go. Up, up. Here, we'll go like this. There you go. There, oh, no, no. Wrong way. There you go. I'm going to get this out of way. How cute. Look at that. Look how beautiful that is. Oh, you move a lot. Successfully got the top on. It was a little bit of a struggle. Welcome home, little buddy. Ephabothus. Ephabopus. Ephabopus. Cyanothus. <laughs> this one's hard. Okay, we're just going to call this one a blue thing because that's what it is. They are a new world. They're not an old, old world, but... They, they have a reputation of having a very nasty attitude, so it is definitely not advised to ever handle one of these guys. They are slow growers. They are deep uh, burrow. They want to burrow, okay? So thank you also for this. Look at this. Oh, he sent me some. What is this? What's this for? I love it. Is this for the spider? Just put a little leaf right there because it's cute. Athletic, athletic reasons. <laughs> I haven't eaten yet. I'm starving. It's right here. It's 
So let's go ahead and open up. And I am going to help help him out. I'm going to make a little hole here. Oh, he's attacking. He's attacking. Oh my god, he's attacking. Here we go. Ay, Dios. All right, he's out. That's amazing. Welcome. Yes, go back that way. Thank you. You're so kind. Whoa. That is one gorgeous spider. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? This, just like my OBT, is in the baboon family. So, Harpactera colprite, if you are a beginner and you want an, an old world, but you're a little intimidated by some of them, my OBT, Tabasco, is... By the way, I have some rehousing videos coming up, but man, that guy... I'm, I, it's very difficult to change his water dish because he, every opportunity, he tries to kill me. So, this guy, super beautiful. Oh, what I was going to tell you. Sorry, I'm getting off track. Like I was saying, if you're a beginner and you would like to have an old world, they are not aggressive. They are going to run and scurry away and hide from you before they attack you. So, dry substrate. And I have right here, water dish chapstick cap. Of course, I have a little skull and every single one of my tarantulas or spiders, if they are, if they have venom and they can potentially hurt you, I have a little miniature skull in them just to mark which ones are which. We're going to, of course, be using our safe box. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to go ahead and fill the uh, water dish up right now. There you go. I'm going to put you right here. There we go. All right, slow. Here we go. It's coming out. All right. Hello. Did you know that you're dangerous? Ooh. I'm gonna just give a little bit of coaxing. Okay, that didn't work. <laughs> Welcome. Oh, shit. You are you are fast. Look at you. You're so cute. Oh, look, I'm shaking his hand. Hello, how are you doing? Very nice to meet you. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, perfect, perfect, perfect. Let's go ahead and get this file out of here. Nice. So, I requested a praying mantis. I love praying mantis, but I've never had one before. So, I asked if I could have one. So, let's see what he gave me. C. gemmatus. This is also known as the jeweled flower mantis. These guys live up to nine months, so that's the sad part. They're gonna molt about eight times before they become mature in about two months. Females are much larger, males are much smaller. Males can live communally. As most of you know, praying mantis have a tendency to be cannibalistic. They want human environments, you want things that they can crawl around on. They make very, very good pets. Uh, they're very, they're pretty easy to take care of. Go ahead and get him in there. Here's his, in here's Here's this enclosure and what I'm going to do is I'm going to take some of this water and I'm going to spray it pretty good and fill that up. Ooh, look at that. Shave that off. <laughs> it's going to take him out like this, I guess. Let's take a look at it. Oh, Are you cleaning yourself? Oh my god. I was told that he might eat because these guys eat like crazy. I'm gonna try to feed him. Let's see if it let's see if he takes it. Cool. Oh there's a cockroach running around my own no! No, Herbert! Herbert, what have you done? Okay, here we go. <gasps> he ate it. Dang! Okay, Savage. Well, guys, that does it for this tarantula video. I hope you enjoyed it. I absolutely love every single little guy I got in that box. Thank you so, so much to KF and Verberids. I love you guys so much. Thank you for watching, and until next time.